I haven't filmed in a while, but I'm back and we're going to film. So before we get started, make sure you guys subscribe, hit the notification bell, and give this video a gigantic thumbs up. So, I'm not sure if you guys know this, but I love art is my favorite thing in the whole entire world. And everyone thinks I'm really good at making donuts. So, I decided that I'm going to make a simple donut with an animal face on it. And you guys do not need to use a Sharpie, but, and I might also make a donut towel. It's super simple. The things you will need will be paper, some kind of drawing thing or a Sharpie or a pencil, markers, color pencils, crayons, and Sharpies or something. So let's get started. Now it's time to make a oval for the donut part. So now once you make the oval, you go at the edge of the donut pot and start making wavy lines for the icing. And then you go in the middle of the icing, like right here, I'll put a dot. And then you start making a Y U to make a 3D. And then at the end of the Y U, leave a little bit of like a line right here and then you just start making another little wavy line in the wide in the middle of the wide U. but the thing that i was talking about about live a little bit of a line means that you have to leave a little bit of um of extra right here so now once you've done that you okay so i'm gonna do a donut stack so it's a little bit more com complicated but a donut's really easy so i'm just gonna tell you the steps now so the so the thing to make a regular donut is in a donut animal is to you you could put any animal and you just add like eels or unicorn or anything you make it your own so like i said i'm gonna do a donut stack so you repeat the same steps. You do another oval, make the icing, the wide U. That was a big wide U. And then you make a little, I don't know how to call it, call, call it a curvy line or something. Oh my gosh, I forgot to add, um, on the first donut, I forgot to add a little tongue. A ton just in the middle, just like that. And now it's time for the third, the last donut for our donut stack. Make the icing, do the U. Okay, guys, so once you did that, I'm going to make a, how do I call it, a unicorn cat a donut stack. So I'm going to make a big horn, and I'm going to add some lines to the horn. And then I'm going to add some details for the cat ears. And then you should do any eyes you want. I'm going to do, hmm, I think I'm going to do a kind of, I don't know, a you sort of, <laughs> a upside down you. So once you did that, you I like to add all faces on the um, donuts to be alive. So you guys don't need to do that, but I'm going to. I'm going to do all different kind of faces. This one I might do this one, like the one I did on the first one. Now, since I, once I did the face, it's time to do the tail. So I'm gonna come to this side because this side is out of room. So I'm gonna come to this side. It might kind of make a squiggly tail. You guys do whatever tail that you guys want. So I'm just kind of adding layers. So once I did that, 
That means we're almost done with our donut. All we have left is to make the sprinkles. I'm going to do, hmm, maybe a few hot sprinkles on the first donut and then regular sprinkles. Look how cool it looks. But it'll look better when we color it. So I'm going to start to color. Now for the final touch, I'm going to go over with my Sharpies for the sprinkles. I love to go over my pictures with Sharpie so it will make it look neater and professional. fun but exhausting also well the final touches here's my picture i'm joking this is not my picture this is my picture do you guys like it i'm so happy that it turned out good good I hope yours turned out as good as mine, or better. Well, I hope you guys like this video, and remember, you guys do not need to make a um make a donut stack if it's a, if a, you don't want to, or if it's too hard. So I hope you guys like this video. Subscribe, click the notification bell, and give this video a gigantic thumbs up. Bye. <sighs> now that. Uh, that work is done.